everyone loves Valheim. I f love Valheim. Taking on the role of an undying Viking warrior barred from entering Valhalla and instead forced into championing Odin's cause throughout the 10th realm by defeating the godlike Forsaken but then becoming a pig farmer instead is a universally praised experience. I recently defeated the last boss and beat what the game currently has to offer with Little Voidy Jr. Wait, I'm not ready? Okay, now I'm ready. But remain hopelessly addicted to getting wood and tediously farming one crop at a time. So I decided to start again on hardcore mode for the first time ever. I've never tried hardcore mode before. And I have to say it's been an incredible gaming experience. Here's how it went. We're going to do the world modifiers. We're going to go hardcore. Okay, combat, very hard. Governs how much damage you give and take. Also governs how likely you are to encounter higher leveled enemies and how dangerous they are. Holy fuck. Death penalty is hardcore. You lose all carried items and skills permanently when you die. Yeah, easy game for babies. Raid rate is more. I don't know how often they'll raid the base, but apparently it'll be more. Portals, no boss portals. Changes how portals will work in the game. You will not be able to use portals or exit boss dungeons while a boss is active. And of course, no map. That is probably the biggest, worst thing that they've done. I am so disoriented and lost right now. Let's make our smexy Viking. Nice and tan, unlike me. No hair, like me. And we go with a nice big beard, unlike me. Hair tone, something like that. There we go. Void core. A brand new character. Start on Voidheim. Hardcore. Off we go, boys. We're on our way to Valheim, carried by a giant birdie Valkyrie. And as you know, all good giant birdie Valkyries have a name. So I decided to call this one Flappy Mac Flappy Wing. The reality of hardcore mode is setting in, boys. How the f are you gonna find the bosses? It's not often people learn anything new on this channel, but I later find out that when you use a a veg Vegvasir Stone, your camera pans to the direction of the boss. Don't forget to like and subscribe for way fewer gameplay tips than you'd get on other channels. 750 hours, yeah, dude. I've got about the same, about 700 hours in this game. See, now is this guy gonna one shot me? I don't know. And I don't know if I wanna try. Um, is this guy gonna stop following me, bro? Can I make a club yet? Hell yeah. How powerful are the enemies in hardcore mode? Oh my. Alrighty. We want to make a flint axe as soon as possible, I think. Logan, you played the shit out of this game. Have you ever played it on hardcore mode? Because I want to find out if this guy's going to one-shot me. And if he kills me, I lose all my skills and all my stuff. Oh, dude, that's easy. What the fuck? I was scared for nothing. Hardcore's for babies, bro. So how the fuck do I find my way back here? Can you use the, the branch as like a guide? Like call that north and south? and call that east and west. Wait, the sun is setting or rising there? Dude, I'm not a scientist, but who the fuck cares? We should maybe just get our little base building so long. And we crafty crafting. Cool, cool, cool. We are going mobile, boys and girls. Can you sneak up on birds? Dude, one more of those and I'm dead, bro. That's the thing. There's a cartography ta table that you can build later, but you can't share detail with anybody because. Please don't kill me. Yeah. Who fucking didn't see that coming? Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Please don't die! Fuck yes, Jesus Christ. Give us a hoe, and we'll do a little base here as like a staging ground for whatever we get up to. What do we need for a crude bow? Boar scraps? Uh, this is ludicrous viking game bro and 
I am gonna die. Oh shit. Let's go. Hail warrior, turn back. This is a dangerous place. You, however, are super brave and skillful. You should venture forth into the Black Forest and get destroyed in the name of content. Because maybe we'll turn this into a YouTube video. This is the smallest Black Forest that ever did forest in the Black. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna die. I'm so disoriented and lost right now. Please stop following me. I don't know if he's going to one-shot me, dude. They are so tanky, dude. What the fuck? It's not a long house until you put a little... Until you do this, bro. Now nah, it's a long house. Hell yeah, dude. Early on in the YouTube days, when I was trying to like find out what kind of content I wanted to make and like how it would all come together. The me. Oh my god. But I did some stuff after I died yesterday and lost all my stuff because it's just hardcore ball hunt. So we started up a little ball pin over here. A one star ball. Oh we already got our piggies. Bro, oh, I thought that, I thought the little pigs ate the big pigs. That'd be pretty fucked up. I think we're basically ready for the boss. All I did was, like, off stream, I fucking made the boar population of the island extinct and the deer population. all my shit and we'll see how it goes man so i've got to literally sail across the fucking ocean to get the first boss madness we're finally on our way to ekthia on a raft and as you know all good ships have a name so i decided to call this one this thing is as fast as an 890 jump could be fucking anywhere dude This way, bro. It has to be this way. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. How the fuck do you know I was here? Just, dude, if this guy hits me, I'm probably dead. Dude, hit the fucking troll. And I'm not rested anymore. Dude. I'm so curious to see how difficult the first boss will be on hard mode. Oh my god. Oh my god. I found it, boys. Oh my god. I'm not proud of this. I'm not fucking proud of this. The, I mean, did the game's basically asking me to do it this way? I'm sorry. Oh, fuck no. I tried. You guys all saw I tried to get him unstuck. Okay, it's not too bad. Oh my god, I didn't know he did that. It's not like this.
Dude, I'm not even hitting him, bro. Okay, dude. Emergency. Repair station. Let's go. Oh, my tits, dude. Fuck. Fuck, dude. My tits. Now, we've got to run up and hit the hammer. Fuck you. Now we do this. And we do this. Okay, I eventually came to the conclusion that this hardcore run was absolutely cursed, so I restarted on another world with a new character. It's a core part of being human, learning from your experiences and overcoming challenges, coming back stronger, building better and fighting harder. It's really rewarding. Thank you channel Patreons and channel members for all your support. If you enjoy my content and are interested in supporting the channel beyond a like and a subscribe, check the links in the description or consider the join button below. It genuinely helps me to continue producing these videos. And don't forget to check me out on Twitch as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you around. Cheers.